Hello YouTube, thought we'd do a quick video on a comment that was made on one of my videos about the 5 8 wave being a better antenna due to the radiation pattern that it emits. Um, I will post a link in the description to this PDF file that you can look for yourself and you can see how the patterns are different on all these different types of antenna quarter wave, half wave, etc, etc. Now if you look at this real quick, you can kind of see what the commenter was talking about. The 5 8 wave does this direction and that direction. Some of the antennas kind of tend to shoot straight up um, and that may not be good depending on your situation. So, and what I mean by that is Perhaps if you have an office in a basement and you got three levels above you and you need to communicate and you need as much signal to go straight up as possible, then you might want to consider the three-quarter wave antenna because that's going to give you the most signal straight up to penetrate those other floors. Now, so every situation is different. Um, so depending on what you need, so... When you decide to build an, build your uh, antenna for your GMRS radio, kind of keep that in mind about the patterns and look at them and say, okay, do I need more signal this way or do I need more signal that way? And that will kind of help you uh, decide what antenna to build. Now, I'm going to be building pretty much all of these. I don't know if I'll be testing them all as in a distance test we'll have to kind of see um, but I'm going to be doing that uh, building them and then I'll do I'll shoot video after I'm done building them and we can kind of do some testing with the nano and stuff like that but at any rate I just kind of want to point out this what the commenter was talking about for some of you that might not f follow what they were talking about again I'll post this link in description to this PDF file but keep in mind what you need your antenna to do. That's also very important along with location of the antenna. So it's a type of antenna, the location of the antenna. Um, those are very important factors. You can have a 50 watt repeater and if you don't have a good antenna and a good location, it ain't gonna do you any good. So, um, but keep those in mind uh, when you decide to build an antenna or even buy one too. What type of pattern it has uh, any questions or comments please post them down below and please subscribe and thank you and have a good day